Okay, let's try this today. So I'm looking at the market as usual every single day. Um, today's market showing me a lot of coming soons right here. Let's see, what are they listed at? They are, well, in the expected range, over 700s in this area. Let's see, there's one that already shows an increase in price. And this is on Bellarive Drive, just close to where I live. So let's look at this one. It was listed, okay, they increased it by a dollar. Um, let's see. This is the one picture, but it, I think they've uh, done up the whole house. New flooring, new doors, and probably new kitchen. So this one's going to be exciting. Um, that's a backyard, nice backyard. I think it's priced pretty well too. We'll see how this one goes. This is clo pretty close to where I live and um, always a place that sells really quickly. So if it's a done up house, then it'll sell really, really fast. So we'll see how that goes. Uh, meanwhile, let me just move this down to the side so I'm not covering up the screen. Um, ba -ba 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 let's see. So those are the ones that are, that are coming soon. Um, let's see what's active. I want to see which are the ones that have been on the market for a bit. So we'll see days on market. Okay. Um, da -da -da -da. Hmm, this one's probably been listed again. So let's see what's going on with this. This is in Castaic. Sorry about the sniffles. The weather's changing. So this is a nice one. You are in the video, are you? Here. Come in the video. I'm not sure if what I feel about kitchens like this. Um, I guess it's a personal preference. It feels very um, like too, too open. Like I, I know people like the whole open floor plan, but for homes like this, I feel like a, an island is an essential. At least a place for people to like hang out. Um, maybe one of the things people can do that is that after they move in, they can install an island here. But that's, again, a personal preference. I'm just not a huge fan of kitchens that are like this. Let's see. What else do we have? Let's go back to the list of homes. Mm. We're going to look at the last page to see which one's been on the market for the longest. This is 297 days. And actually increase the price hmm from 975 it went up to over a million I wonder why I wonder if they did any changes to the house okay that home is not in great shape definitely needs work it's price per square foot is 667 that's pretty high I am not sure why they've listed it as that much. Maybe they went to court and people... Too much. You think so? Let's see. First overbid amount of over a million. Okay. Um, is everybody getting sniffles? I know. I'm sorry. It's just the weather that's changed. Okay. That's, that's very interesting. I guess because it went to probate. Uh, price had to go up. But... Um, on a general trend, if you look, there's been a lot of decrease in prices, right? There's been a few increases. Oh, this is another one, interesting one. That's beautiful. That purple, what is that? It's a five-bedroom, five-and-a-half bath. Is that a swimming pool with lights? Mm -hmm. Is that a swimming pool with lights, that purple? It's one of those new homes. Uh, let's see if it has a yard. I'm <coughs> curious. For that much money, what are you getting from the back? Uh, it's just a balcony. It's not a balcony. It's like a little sit-out, outdoor. There's a front elevation. They just put some lights over there. Oh. Like a little water feature, maybe. That's the inside of the house. Oh. 
That diamond looks nice. It does look nice. It looks fancy, huh? Like we saw an Ikea. <laughs> I guess it's better than Ikea. Ooh, what's that robot TV show? Just a TV show. It's interesting how these, these rooms feel smaller. For all that price that you're paying, it feels really small. Well, they do look small. It does have a pool. <coughs> pool? Yeah, there's a pool right there. I don't know if you can tell, but there's a, a pool right there. It's a bit small to see. So, well... Then why is this fireplace in there? It's not, there's no fire. Oh, uh, well, this is a fire pit. Why but is this inside the water? I think it's to the side. I think the water is on the other side. But anyway, it's interesting because all you're getting for that much money is, you know, not that big of a yard. So... Just a house. Let's see, is it a... Standard two car garage, okay. Two car. Yeah, let's see oh again. My. The price per square foot seems decent. It's thirty nine forty two square feet. Uh, the lot size is not that big, but it's not too bad. This has been on the market for a little bit as well. I'm not sure. Why do they keep increasing the price? Lot. Okay. Uh, that's one point seven. Um. 1.2 blah 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 let's see what how many more price decreases lots of price decreases again lots and lots <coughs> <laughs> yep that's the trend we are seeing so the trend of this Mom. day is that there's been plenty of decreases in price decreases and increase uh, like as the homes have increases. stayed on the market like the filter that i've put in is the number of days on the market right so the longer it stayed on the market the more you see a decrease in prices. The lesser number of days, obviously, not as many price decreases. So right here, it's like just oh one no. because these have just barely been listed. But the market's going to dictate what's going to happen. It's going to be um, a decrease in price if you have not priced the home pri properly, if there's crazy amount of tax assessments on the property, if there's Meller rules, if there's HOAs and stuff. People cannot qualify for it. Additionally, if the home is in a location where there's, you know, um, th there's fire, chances of fire, and it cannot be insured normally, then that's another cause that where the prices have to be more realistic and not whatever the seller wants it to be, right? So those are all expectations that we need to set with the seller, um, working with the insurance agent, working with your vendor partner is very helpful so that you know what kind of a price to go to with the with the seller and let them know that you know if you want your home to sell and you want it to sell in a quick and um, easy manner then the idea is to price it right and you can price it right by checking the location checking the comps checking um, what the homes have uh, that are for sale in the area have have been priced at and how long they've been on the market so doing all of that is very important um i'm going to sign off on this video you want to say bye 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 <laughs> bye uh for this video it's it's after halloween so there's a lot of sniffles there's a lot of um candy eating that's been happened candy <laughs> uh, i'll see you guys soon bye see ya